the Samsung SSD850 line has basically ruled out as the most popular and reliable solid-state drive for most consumers since its launch in 2014. And although Samsung has released some incremental updates over the years to increase capacity storage, the company has announced the first true successor to the iconic 850 EVO and 850 Pro units, the 860 EVO and 860 Pro. As one might guess from the incremental change in the names, the new models are not a massive leap, but a more evolutionary advance for the Samsung models. The biggest change is a change from NAND 3D of 48 layers to NAND 3D of 64 layers, together with an updated SSD MJX driver and DRAM LPDDR4 in place of the DRAM LPDDR3 of the previous generation. As before, Samsung continues to sell both Evo economy models and more premium Pro versions of the 860. The Pro line offers slightly faster speeds and is rated for twice as many global scripts as the Evo line, in large part due to the fact that it uses 2-bit MLC technology, instead of the slower, less reliable, but generally cheaper 3-bit MLC 3D NAND also known as TLC or triple level cell in the Evo series. In general, it is not the biggest update. If you already have an 850 on your computer, it probably is not something you want to rush to get. But if you are looking to purchase a new SSD, it seems worthwhile to choose the updated version 860. The 860 EVO line is available in capacities of 4 terabytes, 2 terabytes, 1 terabyte, 500 gigabytes and 250 gigabytes in a size of 2.5 inches as well as capacities of 2 terabytes, 1 terabyte, 500 gigabytes and 250 gigabytes for the formats M2 and 1 terabytes, 500 gigabytes and options of 250 gigabytes for M SATA. Prices start at $94.99 for the 250 gigabytes model and reach a maximum of $1,399.99 for the 4 terabyte size.